What's up, everyone? We have another episode of Road to Master Crafter, and today I'm going to be working on my gathering skills a lot because as we're getting into the higher levels of these trade skills, it's going to require that I use higher grade materials to get to those 200 levels just because it's taking so much more XP now to level up. So let's go straight over to our trade skills. I'm really going to work on harvesting today. I'm going to get this to 200 for sure. Logging that definitely needs to get to 200 very soon, especially so I can get those legendary materials. <clears throat> but I'm really just working on this right now, and it'll also help get um, my leather working up. That would definitely increase a lot from getting this silk weed, and then uh, woodworking also would help when I do get to my logging. But for now, we're gonna work on my harvesting, and I'm gonna show you exactly where I'm gonna go to farm this up. All right. As you can see here, this is the new world map and we're gonna be farming silkweed. And uh, I believe this is Restless Shore up here and it kind of cuts also into Morningdale. Um, so it's kind of like a Restless Shore Morningdale section here. We're gonna be running up and down this section getting all the silkweed that we can. I'm not even 175 yet, so I can't even get the um, other plants. What is it called here? Wire fiber, I believe it is. Yeah, so I kind of feel bad not even having 175 gathering already. Like, I don't really know why I don't, to be completely honest. But we're going to try to get to 200. So Silkweed is definitely the way to go, in my opinion, at these higher levels. So let's get straight to it. All right, so we're coming up with some Silkweed here. Usual hint gives you around like 90 XP every single time you gather it. And Silkweed here gives you... 335 which is definitely way more than 90 it does take you a little bit while longer plus i'm not you know i don't have any reputation in this area as much so it's gonna take me a little longer than it usually would in other areas but the xp is definitely worth it so i'm gonna be farming here until 200 <laughs> In the comment section, tell me uh, how you guys feel about the bots in this game. Have you been, like, really affected by it? And, like, you know, I'm not sure if it's just my server that just has a couple of them. Maybe other servers are worse than mine. I'm not even sure. But honestly, um, this spot seems fine here. There really doesn't seem to be, like, active, active bots, like, you know, a lot. I did actually run into a bot that was actually moving around the map, and literally, I was following it around because it was literally like a metal detector. I was farming iron, and it would just walk around to every single iron spot, but, like, the bot was kind of bad, so it would, like, find the iron and run into it for, like, a couple seconds before it hits it. So I would go and just take the iron before it did. It was like a metal detector just following around. It was very convenient, but at the same time, it was just, like... It's kind of weird. So, have you guys been affected by that? Go ahead, leave a comment below. You know, what I'm really waiting for is when I'm able to get everything maxed out in my crafting, I can forget about it and go straight into theory crafting. Because I think that's going to be the funnest part of this game is when I really have everything and I can just make endless builds with different variations and different, you know, gear pieces and just really customize. That's what I really want to get into. But, you know, in order to get there, we have to grind. So this is what it is. And, you know, I'm a college student and I work. So I'm not going to be on the biggest grind that everyone else is on. But I'm definitely grinding still. All right, it's been about 30 or so minutes. Coming up on level 170. I think the plan is as soon as I hit 175, I'm going to go ahead and go to the next tier and get the um whatever those red plants are called <laughs> so let's get this 170 real quick boom 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 and boom 170 harvesting i'm gonna get the 175. one thing about the silkweed in this area is that they pop up so quickly like you can literally just do full rotations around the area and most likely they've all respawned already I have never came across a spot that hasn't respawned yet. It's really crazy. One quick tip about this area. All the enemies around here are like around level 45, 46-ish. So 
you're not around that level, you'll probably get annoyed by all the wolves that run around and whatever those lion looking things are, because they'll definitely chase you. So watch out for that. All right, this one right here should get us to 175. And wow, they played me. We'll just go ahead and take some of this hemp right here. Boom, boom, 175, get away from me, you defender, whatever you are. All right, our trace fill is now at 175, so we're gonna get some wire weed. Let me show you exactly where we're gonna get this from. Boom, boom. So, I believe this is called wire, oh, wire fiber, okay, my bad. But we're gonna go into an even higher level area. We're gonna push up to the top here and go straight for this big patch up here because this seems to be the spot. I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of enemies up here and um, for my level, it will get risky. So we're gonna risk it though and see what happens. Okay, completely scratch that spot out. It's not worth it. The enemies target you from like 50 meters away and they just one shot you with their poison. It's not worth it at all. I'm even a tank and it's not even worth it, so. New location. Let me show you exactly what we're going to be at here. Right over here. Uh, this is in Brightwood. 20 to 30 ish level area. Um, I spawned right up in here. So we're going to go around and just take all these. It's not as much, a little more spread out, but it's going to have to work for us. This spot is much better or easier to see also. It's, uh, it's still pretty good amount, like obviously it gives you so much XP, so like you really don't need a lot in the first place, so yeah, this is the move. Alright, I'm running out of time here, and I actually have to get to sleep, but we are at 185, it's not going to take long to get to 200 at all, but if you guys did like this video and it helped you out in any way at all with your harvesting, go ahead, hit that like button. Hit the comment section. Tell me what you guys want to see next. Hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, and I'll catch you guys later. In the nighttime, it get tricky. Mess with me, we send our boys straight to walk. Straight to the back seat. Put them work up in the nighttime, and it's getting tricky. I put my sweat and my tears in this bitch, so I swear to God, it's getting busy.